Hey guys, this is the YouTube guy. So uh, today I didn't, I really did not have much time, and so here, what I was gonna do, I was gonna create a space video, but turns out I don't have enough time for that now. So I'm just gonna be doing a, a like a video. Um, I'm gonna be doing a video about uh, like what we're like uh. Where I'm going to be doing a video about consoles, well, Nintendo consoles first, and then they're like standards, like what was their most popular game, and most popular or most well-known, doesn't have to be popular, well, it doesn't have to be the best-selling, but it should be the most well-known. So, okay, let's go. So, let's start with the NES. Yeah, we get it, we get it, we get it. So, let's start with the NES. Uh, the NES was an 8-bit console, an 8-bit console, and actually I'm not going to be, okay fine, maybe I will, and it's two best-selling games because this was really successful, and, and, uh, Nintendo didn't discontinue it until 2003, that's after the release of the GameCube, so the NES was a hit console, but, uh, it wasn't more than... 60 it might it, it was less than a uh, hundred million units sold so the two most popular games were super mario bros and duck hunt whatever i don't want to correct so next we have the snes and it was a 16-bit console bit bit console and it featured game it was 16 bit console and it featured games that are most popular where is super mario world and legend of zelda link to the past I'm just going to write a link to the past. Next, we got the N64. And this was a 64-bit console. I'm going to write 64. And all the consoles from here are 64-bit. So it's a, oh my god. It's a 64-bit console, and its graphics quality is 480 pixels. No, not 480. 360 pixels. So this is LD, definitely. Low definition. You know, I'm just going to replace it with 360. And then it's 3D, obviously. Uh, game, uh, really good games were Super Mario 64. Yeah, I know. It's always Super Mario. And then GoldenEye 007. This game was actually pretty fun, even though I've never played it. Hey, these consoles came out before I was born, okay? Come on. Next, we got the GameCube. How do I write that? Cube? I don't know. And then it had a better upgrade to 480 pixels. And the N64 in pixel quality was actually better than the PlayStation, which even though came out two years earlier, had a pixel quality of 144 pixels. Like, come on, you can do better. You got CDs. It was 3D. Uh, great games were Smash Brothers M Melee.
and I don't know, and I forgot the other one. Oh, uh, I think it was Mario Kart. No, that was not it. Super Sunshine, actually. So it was Super Mario Sunshine. So, uh, yeah. Lots of Mario games. Then came the Wii. And then the Wii was clearly an awesome console. Even though it only has ED or enhanced, uh, enhanced graphics. I mean, enhanced definition. It also had motion controls and a plethora of incredibly awesome games. Including Wii Sports. I played that. We, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to create more. We Sports Resort, it's sequel. And Legend of Zelda, wait, no. Uh, Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. And, uh, Super Mario Galaxy. Oh, one more game from here is, uh, Animal Crossing. Yeah, that's how pop. That's how many get great games were there. Oh wait, hold on. Haha, I did not leave. Animal Crossing. Ah. Good. So next we got the Wii U, which was a commercial flop. Even though it featured HD. In, even though it featured HD, which is uh, pixels. HD. It was still a commercial flop, and one of the best games on it is, um, uh, uh, nothing. Actually, yeah, there is one. There's new Super Mario Bros, and there was also a Wii Sports Club. The other sequel to Wii Sports. There we go. Then we got the Switch. And then the Switch is actually um, a really powerful concert. It's 1440 pixel. Which... Okay, so it's somewhere between HD and 4K. So let's. So if you round it, it's actually. No. It's 120. 1280. Pixel. No, it's. It's 1440 pixel. And that's pretty powerful. Okay, so it actually is two things. So. It's. Uh, it's one to that for handheld. Actually, that for handheld. And then for dock mode, it's actually 1440p. Uh, memorable games are... Yeah, we, we got a lot of them. So there's Breath of the Wild, Legend of Zelda. Breath of the Wild. Smash Bros. Ultimate. Wait, Super Smash Bros. And that is my personal favorite. I, I was playing it, like, before this. Hey, what just happened? Nah. 
ultimate. Uh huh. Yeah, we get it. We we know the edits won't be saved. Oh my god. I hate Google Docs. Oh wait, this is this this is not even Google Docs. This is Microsoft Word for Windows XP. Why? What am I doing on this? This is Windows XP. Well, not not the operating system. Uh, this Microsoft Word's from Windows XP. So uh, yeah, that's it. Uh, let's discuss the leaks about the Switch. Uh, pro. We're definite. It's gonna be. It's gonna be. Uh. We know that it's gonna be three zero eight zero, aka four K, for the TV. That's four K. Yeah, it's not technically 4K, but yeah, th that that's what PlayStation has currently. It's we know it's going to be 4K for TV. And it's going to be somewhere around for handheld. It's going to be at least less than 2K probably. But that's still a lot of pixels. And memorable games that we might get is Breath of the Wild. Uh, Switch Sports. And then sadly, I think this is the last uh, um, game that Masahiro Sakurai will be making for Super Smash Bros. Sadly. Because he was... If he was planned to be done with Wii U, depending on how bad it is... Uh... Super Smash Bros. Ultimate was still a great success, but I, don't, I people, there's a high, really high chance that he won't be making a new one. Sigh. Okay, guess I'll see you later. Bye.